Once again, there is a, a giant rally taking place in downtown Toronto, down Young Street, all the way to uh, Nathan Phillips Square. These are people who are standing in solidarity uh, with what's happening in Ukraine, with the Ukrainian people. This march was organized by the Ukrainian Canadian Congress, the Toronto branch. One of the things they're uh, urging is that the government, so the Canadian government, should do absolutely a lot more to help the situation which has turned so dire uh, in Ukraine over the last few days. General Rick Hillier among the people addressing the crowd today. How can we stand by and watch the Russian Air Force target humanitarian convoys, places where the majority of the people are, are civilians, and do absolutely nothing? I'm completely in favor of a no-fly zone. I think we should have done it long ago. I think we can start it incrementally by putting a no-fly zone over the humanitarian routes in the western part of Ukraine. With one of the largest Ukrainian communities outside of the country of Ukraine, the Canadian population has been extremely vocal and active in trying to uh, pressure the Canadian government, in fact all governments, to do something about what's going on. I'm totally, totally disgusted by what's going on and I think Putin should be punished to the full extent of the law. The biggest fear right now is that they're not sure exactly what the Russian government, the Russian military is going to do next. The images that they've seen are horrific and they're urging the international community to do much more.